There we go. Hope you didn't mind the reception. When you tango with the Institute, you gotta be careful when someone new gets on the dance floor. May it serve you as well, heck, better than it did Tommy. Alright guys, we are on to the bobblehead portion of this, and uh, this is what we already have. We have the Charisma, Energy Weapons, and Medicine. We should have the Perception, I know I grabbed it, but I have absolutely no idea where it went. I checked there, I checked there, I checked my inventory, and it is just not there. So if any of you guys watched through the series, let me know if I like dropped it at any point in time. Or I don't think you can drop it, but... Um, I checked Piper's inventory. I haven't Mother checked. Nature That's Codsworth. I doubt Kiri hey. would have it. I don't even think I've traded with her. No. But uh, the first step on this is going to be the melee bobblehead. So we're going to head to Trinity Towers. I'll see you there. What the All right, hell are you doing in there? Once you get to the top there? of the Trinity we Towers, you're going to find here. these guys. My brothers will and be I do soon. believe... This is where you get the, the melee weapons bobblehead. And there it is, guys. Next one on the list is the speech bobblehead, which we should have also had. But apparently that one's glitched out too. Alright guys, and the next one on the list is actually the repair bobblehead. I checked the footage back. We did grab the speech bobblehead. There must be some kind of glitch. I don't know why I don't have it. So we're gonna have two missing. The other three we've gotten on screen are all in the bobblehead display case. But we're up here at the top of Corvega assembly plant. The very, very top, you'll see this big blue sphere. You go through it, you go out to the top of the roof, you keep going up and you'll follow the path and you'll get this there guy. We go. Next one on the list, well, we will find out when we get there. All right, now if you uh, come down to Pikmin's Gallery and go all the way through to the end, all the way up to the third floor, down through the walls, help Pikmin out, you will Perfect. get a lockpicking bobblehead, the next one on the list, as well as a couple other things like a Perfect. book or magazine. And if you do let Pikmin live or kill him, you can get his key and behind a painting in the main room you will get the best melee weapon Pikmin's knife or whatever it's called and it is the fastest most DPS weapon so if you guys are doing a melee weapons playthrough this is definitely the place to come lock picking and a knife and a magazine it's all good next up on the list we have the explosives bobblehead which can be found in the Saugus Ironworks, all the way up at the top in the Blast Furnace, yes. which will also give you a quest to help Jake Finch return his shish kebab to his grandfather. Just a little heads up, probably going to do that off screen, so uh, yeah, on to the next one. Alright, next up in the Malden Middle School, we have Vault 75. Make your way down, you'll get a quest as soon as you go down the elevator. Just follow it, you'll get the admin access card, which will lead you to this room, where the science Bingo. bobblehead is. In the next one, we're going to be looking for the medicine bobblehead. I'll see you guys there. Next on the list, we have the intelligence bobblehead, located at the northwest corner of the Boston Public Library. Yes. Fairly easy to get into if you have the lock picking for an advanced lock. Just come in through the, what is it, southwest door? I don't know. Anyway, next up is strength. We're halfway done. At the top of the mass fusion building, if you look over the edge towards the front of the building, you're going to find the Perfect. strength bobblehead, which is awesome. Next up on my list, I do have the agility bobblehead. I will see you guys there. If you make your way over to the wreck of the FMS Northern Star and get all the way to the top, the very tippy tip front of the boat, you will find the agility nice. bobblehead. Pretty nice if you have Aqua Boy and you can just swim from over there, because if you make your way around this place too early in the game, I know there's a legendary Protectron and an Assaultron and all that over there, so it's a lot easier. Save yourself some time as well just to swim. Next up, Endurance Bobblehead. 
Next up on the list, we have the Endurance Bobblehead just down the road from the last one. Sitting nice. on a desk here, right in the middle. If you go from the front entrance through the master lock, 100 times quicker to get here, I promise. There's also there a Tesla go. Science here, if that's interesting to you. I mean, eh. I'll take it either way. Up next, we have the Small Guns Bobblehead. There we go. Located in the Gunner's Plaza, straight through the doors into a master locked room unless you go all the way around and do the blah blah blah. No fun at all. So we got that. There's also a safe key and I do believe there's a magazine somewhere around here. I don't know. Anywho, on to the next one. We should be like 14 right now. Not sure. So apparently Lebowski doesn't like me picking locks in this place, but uh, we got the barter bobblehead. So that's cool and all. We're going to take all this and then kill our way out. The easy ones are coming up. We got one literally sitting on the hood of a car and one sitting in a boat. So uh, let's go get them. <laughs> yeah. Alright ladies and gentlemen, we are back approximately two hours later. G and I got up at the butt crack of dawn and decided to go to town and walk around with our Pokemon Go. Got some massive gains and I'm now officially a gym leader. This is the Luck Bobblehead. If we take a look at our little map here, you can see that we are way over here just east of the Warwick Homestead. And like I said, Bingo. this one and the next one are going to be pretty easy. The last couple, not so much. I'll show you in a second. And just like that, not even a minute of game time later, we are here just north of Poseidon Energy at Adam Cat's Garage. And if we just walk straight ahead as soon as we get in here, right on the hood of this car, we will have the unarmed bobblehead. Perfect. Not that we're ever going to use it, but it is nice to have all the bobbleheads. You never know. On to the next one. All right, and here at the Dunwich Borers, we have the Sneak Bubblehead. There we go. It's all the way down here by terminal number four. Kind of a pain to get to. Honestly, I'd rate it a little bit higher on the annoyance scale than the Charisma Bobblehead. The Charisma requires a lot more to do, but this one's just a pain. Like, look at all of this mess. Next bobblehead. Crikey, now here's a sight for sore eyes. A big gun's bobblehead in its natural habitat. It's the last of its kind. Excellent. We're gonna take it. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is every bobblehead. I'm really upset about the fact that two of them just magically disappeared from the game, but, uh... That's all we got. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, I will see you hopefully back with G in the next one. Y'all take it easy now.